What did I tell you, honey? Isn't it beautiful? Far away from all that high-tech noise. I guess. Seems a bit dirty, though. Ah, oh, it builds character. Is it just me, or do the other Krogan not like me? Oh, there's some concern about me bringing in a non-Krogan. I had to talk to the Chief a little. It's not a deal. Wait, so they don't even want me here? Who cares what they want? I want you. That's all that matters. I don't know if I can do this, Char. Hey, now. My blue rose of Ilium always stands strong to reach toward the sun. Okay, I'll manage. Just no more poetry. What did I tell you, honey? Isn't it beautiful? Far away from all that high-tech noise. I guess. If you're looking for work, you're shouting down the wrong hole. The Blood Pack only recruits Krogan. You again. I told you the Blood Pack only wants Krogan. Go flash your smooth skin somewhere else. I thought coming to Tachanka would get me away from jaw-flapping aliens. I was obviously mistaken. 
If you're looking for work, you're shouting down the wrong hole. The blood pack only... The clan leader wants to speak with you. Talk to him soon, alien. If we decide you're not welcome, you'll know just before we kill you. Take your business to the clan leader. Take your business to the clan leader. Someday we'll get off this rock and show those Turians who's boss. Damn right. Tear their scales off and let the Pijaks feast on them while they're still alive. Ha! And the Solarians, too. Those little bastards think they're so smart. Needed us to fight the Rachni, though, didn't they? Couldn't take us in a fair fight. Pick to use diseases. That's a gutless way to win. I wonder what those Turians and Solarians look like up close. Nobody around here but more Krogan. It'd be fun to kill someone else for a change. A good fight's a good fight. Doesn't matter who it's against. Yeah, I guess you're right. Still want to tear off some Turian scales, though. <laughs> Someday. Someday we'll get off this rock and show those Turians who's boss. Erdnot clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Good. Talk to Scout then. Or Chief. Either one acceptable. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. I suggest asking the local clan leader for assistance with Grunt's problem. Were you around when the female camp sent the children over last week? No. I was off dealing with a Varen attack. What? Any promising warriors? Yes, of course. They're strong. One day they will tear our enemies apart. You don't want anything I sell, human. It'll tear your insides like you swallowed knives. <laughs> Good Varen. Stay. Nice knife. Looks really... silent. And it fit in my hand perfectly. Maybe when we're done with the mayhem thing, I could come back and... recover a thing or two. I lost half my stock in a bed on the pits. And it was the good half. One of the children, probably five years from the right. He had my eyes, I think. Huh. Think you actually had a fertile female on one of your trips to their camp? I... I must have. A son? Good for you. We'll get a ring call to celebrate. Every time someone shoots a pie jack, my inventory grows. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I've got. Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnot. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rin calls a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal, which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. What the hell is a pie jack? Off world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. 
Why'd you call the Pijaks off-world vermin? An alien trader landed here a few years back. He had goods he salvaged from some place called Elitania. Said they were stowaways. They swarmed off a ship and started stealing food and shitting everywhere. I can't imagine you let him walk away after that. Not a chance. One ball of Pijak dung nailed the leader of Clan Forsan across the forehead. <laughs> That's apparently grounds for execution. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the Pijaks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the Pijak population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. I should go. Suit yourself. The child. My son. We played tackle the Baron. It was... He was good. Fast. Strong. Well, of course he was. Any son of yours must be. Then they went back to the female camp. It was so fast. I didn't get to talk with him. See that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Or fixing something if you can't hunt. It was a special vid on the Citadel. The Citadel Presidium has a big statue of a Krogan right in the middle. <laughs> well, I'm not putting a damn Asari statue up here if that's what you want. Don't be a fool. You're honoring our fight against the Raptor. Maybe they could have honored us by not bombing us with the Genophage. I'll tear you apart! You don't have the plates to try. I've had enough of you! Then let's end this. Tur-Alan was found on an uncolonized planet in the Dranic system. Salvage teams reported no survivors. Eyes straight ahead. Go away. The envoy to the female clans doesn't have to listen to aliens. I may be young, but I relay the wishes of the females. That's important. I don't care who you are. The female clans don't see anyone. Ever. Speaking for the females is an honor, even if it delays my rite of passage. Say otherwise, and I'll kill you. Go away. The envoy to the female clans... Go away, alien. I talk to no one about our rights unless my clan leader wills it. Go away, alien. I talk to no one about our rights unless my... Don't crowd the ambassador. I'll never back down. Then I'll put you on your back. The Systems Alliance Parliamentary Subcommittee for Transhuman Studies has awarded reparations for biotics. Don't crowd the ambassador. Turn back, human. I may be an ambassador among my people, but that doesn't mean I have to speak to the likes of you. Leave now before my guards decide to reject you. You seem like a well-traveled Krogan ambassador. I am. Then you must know who I am. And you have to be aware that bad things happen to those who oppose me. <sighs> Stand down, men. I'm starting to like this human. I am the ambassador to Erdnok from Clan Nakmore. We're a small clan based in the Kranic Wastes. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Kral, who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. What business does clan Nakmor have with the Erdnot? Clan leader Rex requested that I come. He and clan Nakmor have been in talks about a more permanent alliance. With our help, Erdnot could rally others behind its banner and truly unite Tuchanka. 
and we would gain the chance to fight in larger battles with greater plunder. I thought all Krogan want to be warriors. What makes a Krogan become an ambassador? Huh. You don't know as much as you think, human. A Krogan diplomat has to represent the strength of his people, or his clan appears ripe for conquest. I slaughtered my way to the top of my clan, human. I speak with the authority of a warrior. I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. Make your move! You dare taunt me? The Turian government is considering further reparations to humans whose ancestors died in the Relay 314 incident at Shashi. She's mine! Show me you're worthy! You're dead, old one! Step forward, and I'll kill you! This is not the time! Backing down already! I can see your doubt, old man. Yeah, I doubt you'll survive this. I'll tear you apart. You don't have the plates to try. The Citadel has these huge arms, and millions of people live there. Why do you care so much? You gonna leave to Chunka? Run off with the damn blood pack mercs? No. Then shut up and quit yammering about what you'll never see. Halt. You must wait till the clan leader summons you. He is... in talk. You know what tradition demands. Clan Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time, Shepard. Good enough? Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> Out of my way. Shepard! My friend. You look well for dead, Shepard. Should have known the void couldn't hold you. Looks like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. Uh. You made the rise of Erdnot possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erdnot. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Speak when spoken to, Uvenk. I'll drag your clan to glory whether it likes it or not. Now, Shepard, what brings you here? How's the Normandy? Destroyed in a collector's surprise attack. I ended up spaced. Well, you look good. Ah, the benefits of a redundant nervous system. Yeah, humans don't have that. Oh, it must have been painful then. But you're standing here, and you've got a strong new ship. Takes me back to the old days. Us against the unknown, killing it with big guns. Good times. I'm looking for a Salarian. He was captured by the Blood Pack and brought here. My scout commander can direct you. He's probably near the perimeter running target practice. Don't take too much of his time. I need a constant watch on the other clans. I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. Replace me, huh? Well, I can't tell what's wrong if I can't see him. Bring him next time. The off-world Varen probably caught something weak and human. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. 
We are making a neutral ground where all clans are welcome. Fertile females can be shared among clans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. You threaten everything that makes us strong. It will not last. Maybe. Until then, you're lucky to be a part of it. How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. Allies from other clans like what I'm doing. They help deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. What's so important about maintaining individual clans? Every clan has different customs. Rites of passage, rules of behavior, battle songs, all unique. That diversity makes us great. No clan, not even mine, was meant to survive on its own. Erdnot is the leading clan. Doesn't that make your culture primary? For now. But every clan has its unique assets. The best tacticians are Erdnot. Jorgal has the longest breeding line. Gatatog holds the oldest settlement. Others have their own strengths. We keep going how we are. The clans will end up as craters under nuclear haze. Even Erdnot. We need to rethink. Restart. What do the women of Clan Erdnot think about this plan? It was our female clan leader's idea. The neutral area is safe, and it encourages more female clans to ally with us. Attacks on Erdnot now endanger the females of all clans. Even clans that want to see me dead will defend Clan Erdnot. Your women have their own clan structure? Nothing is more valuable than a fertile female. We know it. They know it. They isolate themselves for their own protection. We work together to set up breeding alliances. I can hardly do anything without clan leader Yuta's approval. I hope that works well for your people. But back to the reason I'm here. We don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchanka, but you're an exception. Good to see you, Rex. Sure you can't come with us? Wish I could. But I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. I have nothing to say to aliens. I have nothing to say to aliens. Put down some real money, human. Put down some real money, human. Watch it, human! Eyes straight ahead! Don't touch anything. Give me a reason. Things would last longer if they didn't hit every crater. Krogan's hit by genophage. Nuclear assaults. Civil wars. Still survive. 
Impressive to see life adapt, continue despite circumstances. Inspiring. Should you be in here? Who are you? I am Fortak, Lord High Researcher in Matters Scientific for Clan Erdnot. And I don't have time to answer your inane questions. I won't take up much of your valuable time. My work is very important, human. Of course it is. I'm just curious. I'd heard a lot about the genius of Krogan science. Oh, finally, someone understands. I swear I am among brainless piejacks here, toiling among savages. I am the Lord High Researcher. You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best offensive ordinance yet. A real ground pounder. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines and agriculture? Yeah, yeah, what else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. Sounds like the new clan leader has some very different ideas on how to lead the Krogan. If you want to know more, talk to him directly. He's my leader. I'll not say anything else about him. I take it you're a scientist. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. Not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. Always want more shock absorption, those babies. Give me a reason. Step back. My Varen is hungry. What do you want, human? Rex told me to be polite. He didn't say you were going to talk to me. I'm looking for a Salarian. The Blood Pack captured him and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Salarian. Poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Werelock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base, if you've got the quads to deal with him in the blood pack. What can you tell me about Clan Warlock's base? Last I heard, the clan was holed up in an old hospital. I haven't seen it, though. I've only seen Clan Warlock from a distance. If I'd gotten closer, I'd have taken a shot. You get inside, though, bring a big gun. Warlock's base is crawling with blood pack. That doesn't sound too defensible. Why'd they hole up there? Any hospital on Tachanka has to be built well enough to withstand a bunch of enraged Krogan. When an injury forces us to switch over to secondary organs, things get messy. Higher thought processes don't always transition properly. Blood rage, they call it. What's Clan Warlock's reputation? And how are they involved with the Blood Pack? Tough humps. And they're not friendly, like we are. You ever run into the Blood Pack? Mercenary gang. Clan Warlock started it. One of the only gangs with an off-world presence. They're fanatics. Totally devoted to Warlock Guld. Whatever they did with your Solarian, Guld's behind it. What makes Guld so special? He's got two children. One of them is a girl. Some people think he's got a destiny. Not me. I had a cousin who won 20 consecutive games of Quasar. Lucky bastard. 
I'd ask my cousin for a loan, but I wouldn't swear allegiance to him. Luck. That's all it is. Same for gold. But the Blood Pack has non-Krogan members like Vorcha. Ha! <laughs> the Vorcha. They're just like the Varen. Only they can use guns and don't crap on the floor as often. The Krogan are the only real members of the Blood Pack. Anyone else is just there to soak enemy fire. Any idea what they're doing with the Solarian? I assume they wanted to torture him. You don't take somebody home just to kill them. It's messy. Maybe he pissed off the Blood Pack, and they brought him here for special treatment. No skin off my hump what they'd do with him. One less alien on Tachanka. You don't seem to have much love lost for aliens. Don't get your quads in a twist. If I was gonna kill you, you'd know it. Rex believes we need to unite the Krogan people. I don't think we can do that with off-worlders interfering, but it's not my call. Thanks for the information. Anything that gets rid of the damn off-worlders. You can take the truck over there. You need anything else? Can you tell me more about your duties out here? Fire away. Gotta let my peace cool off anyway. The other scouts wouldn't accept a commander overloading his gun while shooting at vermin. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that, our women and children get the security. Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, a clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire on non-combatants. Taking care of your food supply would help more in the long run. If Clan Jordan kills our guards and helps itself to our well-secured food, there won't be a long term. This is Tachanka. Having power and clean water means we're living in luxury. You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Varen here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol, keep them honest. What does the scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide-and-seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers. That's not recon, that's sabotage. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. Everyone knows where Erdnot is, human. It's not like we can hide. So every clan on Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. Thanks for the information. Good luck out there with Warlock and the Blood Pack, human. You'll need it. Look at him run! Ha!
One wrong step, Shepard. Should I ask the female clan for right of parentage? Why bother with all the politics? You know you've sired a son. That's enough. But I could teach him to hunt. Uh, the best way to shoot a gun. To fight with honor and savagery. Eh, you can do that next time they bring the children over. It's not the same. The envoy from the females is here. Snotty runt. Seeing those vermin roasting in the heat from an explosive shell, I swear it was glorious. It was a lot of fun. Help yourself to more. There's no shortage of pie jocks out there if you get a craving for violence. I'll give you a discount at my store. Anything you want, you buy at cost. I should go. Suit yourself. Here, try this. <laughs> Looks like Urs finally found someone to follow around. I just wish... I don't know. Things could be different. We could live together, us, the women, the children. You know we can't. We'd just be one big, weak target. Have to keep the fertile females safe. The children safe. Damn the genophage. I think I'll take you up on that ring hole later. You say you're happy here in this camp? Where the power doesn't work half the time? And Pyjox and Varen and other clans are always trying to kill us? Yes. And you know why? Because I don't look at that damn extra net. Who cares what human colonies are getting attacked? Who cares who's declaring war? This camp? These rocks? This is all we're ever gonna see. This is we. The Citadel was damn pretty, though. So's the sun. Stare at either of them for too long, you go blind. You see that special they had on the extra net? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Fixing something if you can't hunt. Who's a special bit on the Citadel? I've had enough of you! Then let's end this. Are you a threat? Go away, alien. I'll talk to no one about our rights and I'll never back down. Then I'll put you on your back. The Citadel Presidium has a big statue of a Krogan right in the middle. <laughs> well, I'm not going to damn it, so. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We're making a neutral ground where all clans can share resources and fertile fields. Foolishness. All of it. Well, this sounds ambitious. How's it gone so far? Better than I'd feared. Worse than I'd hoped. It can't continue. You are going against what makes us strong. Sounds like you're not making friends. Traditionalists like Uvenk are chained Varen. Always fighting. Guarding their pathetic stick in the ground. When the smoke clears, I can plant the flag on their corpses and rally the rest around a new Krogan hub. I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaohs and Ilos. Were you around when the female camp sent the children over last week? No. I was off dealing with a baron. But you promised a warrior. And the 
Solarians, too. The little bastards think they're so smart. Take your business to the clan leader, and keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right soon, or put him down. You know what's wrong with him. What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. Take your business to the clan leader, and keep Just your running- Just let me running. by. I have business to take care of. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. Where are you from, whelp? Was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank-bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite warlords. But you are the offspring of a syringe. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. He is dead. Of course. You're with Shepard. How could he be alive? I need Grunt back up to speed. What's wrong with him? There's nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. Ah, puberty ritual, common among species with hormone-driven reproductive urges. I don't care what aliens call it. Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Your clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Idiot. So, Grunt, do you wish to stand with Erdnot? What does the rite of passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The Shaman will discuss that. You'll let a tank-bred Krogan join Clan Erdnot? Only because he's with you. After all, you and I killed thousands like him. Not quite as big, but many. Clan Erdnot is strong, and the others will do as I say. They see the benefit of my vision. What happens if he doesn't do this rite of passage? If he was left here, he would be killed. The clanless are not respected. A tank bred, probably more so. His disposition is what it is, right or no. That's just him being a Krogan. Okir didn't tell you that in the tank. Did he, boy? This is his choice. It is in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. This is the great Krogan homeworld. This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. Never thought I'd miss the tank. Citadel has these huge arms, and millions of people live there. Why do you care so much? <laughs> <laughs> One 
one wrong step shall... You go beyond yourself, Gatatagu Vank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right could ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. I'm not fighting over this nonsense. Grunt's ready. Let's get to it. I like your dismissal of our rituals even less than Uvank's challenges. And my word determines whether a rite will proceed. If this must stand on ritual, then I invoke a denial. My Krantz stands against him. He has no one. Mm. My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt, who is your Krant? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf? How is a candidate tested if he brings backup on his rite of passage? Not every Krogan can be the strongest warrior, but each must inspire his peers to battle at his side. If the ones who know you best can find nothing worthy in you, you should wander the wastes and die alone before you weaken my clan. We stand with Grunt as shipmates and comrades. Shipmates are not the same thing. But I grant you aliens your simple interpretation. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true, Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. What the hell is your issue? What have you got against Grunt? It doesn't matter if one of our own made him. He is a manipulation. He may as well be the genophage in the flesh. The genophage defines the weak. My bloodline will make us stronger. You sound like Rex. Bringing radical change that threatens our core. We have gone too far already. This is about politics. You maneuver like the Citadel Council. Does your Krant also fight with words? You dare slander me in such a way? Impressive! You challenged with words, their natural weapon. And your Krant sees how your position weakens, Uvank. Shaman, you cannot decide in his favor. What about Krogan tradition if you pollute the right? You... you dare. I was a warrior before your mother was born. I speak with the authority of centuries. I decide who is worthy. That is the end of it. I have other means to oppose this. You have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're your problem now. We've waited long enough. Tell us how this works. Still your impatience, Shepard. For now, know that Grunt will be tested, and that you must adapt. Do we need any special equipment? To begin the rite, only the candidate and his crant are required. You love battle, don't you, Shepard? The last gasp of a dying opponent. Bring your love of the fight to Grunt's trial, and he will succeed. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere, will he? During the rite of passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. We'll return when we're ready. When the young Krogan is prepared, bloodshed in the rite must not be rushed. One wrong step, Shepard. I'll tear you apart! You don't ever say you're happier in this camp. The power doesn't work half the time. If my jocks and Baird and other plants are always fine. One of the children, probably five years from the right. Yeah, my eyes. I think. Uh. not clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Someday we'll get off this rock. Show those Torians who fall. Terrible, right? Tear their scales off and let the Pijaks feast on them while they're still alive. Ah! You 
see that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. I've had enough of you. We'll never... F Are you ready to begin the rite of passage? Be warned. Once it has started, you must see it through. To success or death. We'll come back. When the young Krogan is prepared, bloodshed in the rite must not be rushed. Rex knows what he's doing. I'll never back down. Then I'll put you a Citadel Presidium as a big statue of a Krogan right in the middle. <laughs> well, I'm not putting a damn Asari statue up here. That's what you want. Don't be a fool. Take your business to the clan leader, and keep your running pen. You again. I told you the Blood Pack only wants Krogan. Go flash your smooth skin somewhere else. I thought coming to Tachanka would get me away from Jaw Flappy. What did I tell you, honey? Isn't it beautiful? Far away from- If you're looking for work, you're shouting down the wrong hole. The Blood Pack only recruits Krogan. 